Yo, what's good guys? JC here today from Fittest Gamers, and we've discovered something new in WWE 2K22, and it is how to win the Royal Rumble. It's simple. Damage your opponent, perform some combos, some heavy combos and some light combos and grab combos. The, the famous grab combo is square X circle. Once you do that, when the clock appears, Irish whip your opponent, and when you Irish whip your opponent, they're going to hang on, they're going to do the hanging on animation, and all you have to do is hit square, and they're gone. You do this, and you'll easily win the Royal Rumble. It'll happen all the way to the end. I discovered it after doing, like, my fifth elimination doing this, and every time the clock popped up, it worked. Now, the biggest do's and don'ts in the Royal Rumble of how to win, so to speak, do not do a finisher on a brand new opponent if they're high overalls, because if they reverse it, there's a chance you're going to go overboard. Secondly... Do not do that maneuver I just did when there's multiple people in the ring. Because when you do that and you're hanging onto the rope for a second that you're resting, the AI could come and clothesline you out and you automatically lose and all the hard work goes to waste. So, what is the key to this? Damage your opponent. You could do running heavy attacks, which is you run and then hit X like I did there. And then do a grab attack, which is running and hit circle. And then you have square. And you could perform the famous grab combo that is square x circle this is gonna allow you guys to win i did this in my rise and it worked like a charm imagine in my rise by the way the trophy does not get unlocked it gets unlocked against pl single player mode against the ai so you'd want to do it with like a brock lesnar type and isn't it you know be easy brock lesnar roman reigns someone of that caliber high overall should be with ease because my creative superstar is not that high so yeah that is exactly how you win the Royal Rumble game mode. You do damage to your opponent until the clock runs out. Perform the grab combo and you're ready to go. Once the clock appears, it's showtime. That's it. This was the point in time where I discovered, hey, this actually works. When the clock appears now, I'm going to Irish whip Matt Riddle over the ropes. He's going to do the hanging animation. The hanging with two hands. I hit him. Boom. Next guy up. Same thing, rinse and repeat, and that is exactly how you're gonna win the War Rumble. Uh, it's 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 an easy, easy, easy task. I can't believe I found a way to cheese it. I can't believe it actually works. I suggest you Irish whipping your opponent every time the clock pops up. You have about you'll be able to do three good maneuvers to your opponent before that clock runs up, as I did there. I did three offensive maneuvers. The clock pops up. I'm going to Irish whip Booker T. He's going to go over the ropes, and he's gone. It's that simple. This is exactly how you do it. So, I mean, if you guys have any questions about how to win a Royal Rumble, this is it. I'm trying to keep it short and sweet for you guys. not trying to make this a 20-minute video. Just kept it short. You guys are seeing right here how it happens. I don't know if it's like a little Easter egg, like a Brock Lesnar mode. Like what he did in the Royal Rumble when he was in it. I do think it's it's something weird with the game. It really is weird. The fact that they hang on like that whenever the clock pops up. Uh, it doesn't matter if you do it when there's 10 seconds, when there's 7, when there's 4, when there's 3. I don't suggest you doing it when the opponent is already in the ring. Because when they're in the ring, well, when they're in the ring, uh, and you do that maneuver. If you do not reverse the clothesline, you are in trouble. So... This is it. This is how you win the War Rumble. How to win the War Rumble in WWE 2K22 could not be any easier. And yeah, if you have a signature, just do the signature. After one signature maneuver, the clock is going to pop up. And then you're going to be able to Irish whip them out. So it still works like a charm no matter what. Either way, it's working. Um, and then even even if they hang on like that, all you got to do is hit square. And they're going to go right out. He was stunned, of course, but I did do my signature. So it just works out. I really, I did not expect this to work this way, and it did. So I'm like extremely shocked. I'm a bit surprised. And sometimes I do Irish whip them. Like I said, I don't recommend doing your finisher on a fresh opponent. You're going to learn the hard way like me, and you're going to get eliminated at 28 because you're going for a finisher, and they reverse it. Then you're going to get in trouble. <laughs> then all the hard work goes to waste. So, yeah, guys, that's how it's done. I hope you guys find this helpful, resourceful. We'll show you the whole playthrough as when we won our War Rumble in my rise. It was pretty cool, pretty fun, super exciting. So we'll show you guys the whole playthrough. Guys, make sure you leave a like, comment, and sub if this helped you. Please, let's get to 5K now. We got to 4K. Can we get to 5K before the end of May? 
may be too much to ask for. I might have to grind a little more videos before we get there, but we'll get there. So thank you guys once again. You better brush your teeth, wash your hands, and clean your ass. JC from Fittest Gamers, guys. Check us out on Instagram. Check us out on, what's that called? TikTok. Check us out on all major platforms because we will make it available. Um, but yes, keep doing this, guys. The maneuver is about two to three combos uh, or attack maneuvers or offensive maneuvers and then you'll be able to eliminate them i didn't want to cut it so short i wanted you guys to make sure that you understood exactly what i'm saying so make sure that you perform that it's a little exploit it is an exploit in the game i don't think they meant it to be this way but it was so we're just benefiting from it and luckily i was able to discover this for you guys if it wasn't for me just toying around with this i don't think <laughs> I don't think I do this video. I was like, yo, how could you win the Royal Rumble easily? Because it used to be easier, and they got a little hard in this game. And I'm like, oh, I'm going to win it now. Because I just started my rise. I literally just done like five matches in my rise, and I'm already going to you know, go to WrestleMania, headline WrestleMania, because I won the Rumble. And it wasn't one of those things where if you lose, something else will happen. No, I just I wanted to win. I'm going to win this Royal Rumble. I'm going to get my money's worth. I'm going to go to WrestleMania, and I'm going to win that title as fast as I can. And I made it happen. Fortunately for me, I got lucky. So this was a good playthrough. Just happened to get lucky with this. Extremely lucky with this. So, yeah, super lucky, super, super lucky in how this worked out. Perfect timing, I guess. Man, I'm doing my finisher for fun. I should have just done it to eliminate him, but, you know, it's the maneuver thing. This, the clock is going to pop up, and when that clock pops up, it's fair game. Right there, maneuver, he's gone. So, it just works out. It works out perfectly fine. Once again, guys, leave a like, comment, and sub. JC from Fitness Gamers. Remember to brush your teeth, wash your hands, and clean your ass. God bless you all. Thank you for tuning in. I'm, I'm going to try to go for the fastest Royal Rumble ever. I'll probably do that later this week, maybe. I'm going to try to win it in under, like, 15 minutes or something. I think that's entirely possible. So, thank you guys once again, man. We're going to log out now. God bless you all. Thank you, man. Get us to 5K. Let's do this.